apologies in advance, everyone. I lost my voice, so as long as you bear with me, I promise that I have a crazy dreading story to share with you. It's hilarious. Meet the 130-year-old Galapagos tortoise named Diego. He is credited with saving his species from extinction thanks to his high sex drive. Diego spent 30 years at San Diego Zoo breeding program before returning back to Ecuador in 1977, joining his fellow tortoises at the Charles Darwin Research Station. The thing about Diego is he's estimated to have fathered 40% of all tortoises on Española Island in the Galapagos. Just going off of pure numbers here, the population went from 15 to 2,000 tortoises. So why are we talking about this now? It's because Ecuador's environmental ministry announced on Friday that it decided to end the 40 year captive breeding program on Española Island. So Diego's officially retired, he's in quarantine now, and is set to be released back to the island of Española in March of 2020. In other trending news, Philippine authorities have urged a total evacuation of nearly a half a million people near the capital of Manila after a volcano spewed ash up to nine miles in the air. While this emergency is going on on Sunday, here's this married couple that didn't back away from their wedding plans. Chino Valflor and Cap Autista Palomar were booked to get married on Sunday at a wedding venue only a short distance from Tall, that volcano I mentioned. Oh, more royal talk. The Queen is set to talk to Prince Harry today officially about everything that's going on in the crazy, crazy world of him wanting to step away from everything. Sweet potatoes and carrots are being airdropped to help endangered brush-tailed wallabies as fires continue to burn in Australia. And finally, Anthony Davis Jr. takes his spot among Packers fans at Lambeau Field. This is Five Snow. Hopefully my voice is better tomorrow. I'm Nat Cardona. We'll see you then.